Yo, what's good, gang? This is the dope guy, and I am back with another video, big dog. Happy Monday to y'all, man. Hope you guys have an amazing weekend, bro. We are here. It's the start of a new week. Oh, God. But yeah, man, today's video is everyone Drake took shots at on, on the album Her Loss, bro. Drake and 21 Savage, when they came out with the album, Her Loss has been almost a week and a half, bro. Super dope album, bro. I ain't even gonna hold you. Like, few of my favorite tracks so far on the album is Major Distribution, Privileged Rappers, Spin Bout You, Hours in Silence. That's my favorite one. When you and your feelings, Hours in Silence is gonna hit you, bro. It's like a seven minute track. That's fire. More M's and P in millions. You know what I'm saying? With Travis Scott, man. Drake took some shots on some people, bro. Like Meg The Stallion. Uh, I forgot shorty name. What's her name? I, I don't even know her name, but it's, a, it's another chick. Uh, Con, they said Kanye, he took shots at all of them, bro. So I know this video is going to be crazy. Who who else he took shots at that we all might have missed? So I know this video is going to be crazy. But before we hop into it, subscribe to the Dope Guy. That way to get notifications every time I upload. And from me right here on Snapchat, the Instagram right across the bottom of the screen. So with that being said, I am not going to hold y'all much longer because y'all already know. Let's go, big dog. Let's get into it. Yes, sir. Frank and 21 Savage just linked up for a collab project. And Drizzy really brought the heat. Yeah, it was Drake fire. Was it was a dope album. And direct shots aimed at some of the biggest names in the industry. Mm -hmm. And today, we're breaking down everyone that Drake dissed. Let's get right to it. After beefing for a few years and sending shots back and forth, Drake and Kanye finally squashed it last year. Yep. At the benefit concert for Larry Hoover. Yep. Jay Prince stepped in to help calm everything down, and it looked like Ye and Drake were finally moving on. But on the track Circo Loco, Drake made Circle it clear Loco. that the situation between him and Ye isn't over yet. He rapped, linking with the ops. I did that shit for Jay Prince. I did it for the mob tie, and I've never been the one to go apologize. Me, I'd rather hit him up one more time. Yeah, I remember Basically, that. He's saying he only stopped sending shots at Kanye because of Jay Prince. Yeah. Prince is a legend in the rap game who started rap a lot records. He has a lot of influence in, Houston. in the industry, but even he couldn't hold Drake back for long. Kanye has been wilding out lately and sending shots at everyone, especially Jewish people. But instead of clapping back with some more crazy talk, he up online and said he wanted peace. Drake sending shots at Ye is also surprising since Kanye just called him the greatest rapper ever. He did he say that. Drake, Drake is the greatest rapper ever. It doesn't look like Kanye is going to jump back into the beat. But some fans think this will be enough to get Pusha T back into the situation. If he get put, bro, Pusha T is with all the shits, bro. Pusha T is one of my favorite rappers, bro. One of my favorite rappers. You know what I'm saying? Top 10, top 5 favorite rappers, bro. I love Pusha T, bro. Drake don't want no issues with Pusha T. Leave Kanye and leave all them alone, bro. Because Pusha T, yo, four years ago when he did the, uh, I forgot I forgot the name of the track. I'm blanking right now. But you know what I'm saying? When he mentioned his kid and all that. Leave him alone, bro. Leave him alone, dog. Story of Adidon. That's what it's called. Leave him alone, bro. I swear to God. You don't want no smoke with Push. Kanye, Drake also went after Megan Thee Stallion. Yep. The lines. I just put him on the jet. Now they all Italian. Way on dressing till I've been to a thousand islands. This lie about getting shots. Yeah, that was crazy. She didn't even get the joke. She still smiled. Later in the verse, he says, and she took a score. Now Shorty got a hydrate. And he did some dirt. Now my Crody got a migraine. Crody's a slang term from Toronto that Drake has used before in his verses. But his homie Tory Lane also uses it all the time. So people think he said it on this track to tie in with the Megan bars. At first, Megan said people were just attaching her name to the line without any evidence. Yeah. But later she tweeted, stop using my shooting for clout. She and did she say that. Rappers and fans for making jokes about women getting shot and supporting a dude who abused her. Drake allegedly sent Megan another shot on the bar. Shorty said she graduated. She ain't learned enough. Play your album, track one. Okay, I heard enough. Yeah. Megan graduated from Texas. Southern she did, University man. Shout out to Megan. With a Bachelor of Science degree and plans to open up an assisted living facility with her rap money. Obviously, that wasn't enough to stop Drake from airing her out. Not at all. People think the line was just talking about women getting BBLs, but that's not how Megan and a lot of fans took it. Drake isn't the only one sending shots on the album. On the track 3 a.m. on Glenwood, 21 aired on Charleston White and Mace with the bar. See my ops, I jump out and chase him. I ain't Charleston White, I never Mason. Love for all my artists, I never Mason. Yeah. Shit, that's probably why they hate him. YouTuber Charleston White went viral back in July when he made Soldier Boy after Soldier and his goons surrounded him. I heard it. White Soldier hopped out with like a dozen goons and tried to walk up on him. And that's when White took out his mace and sprayed the whole crew. Soldier clowned him on IG for talking tough online, then pulling up with Mace. Yeah. Apparently, 21 wasn't impressed with the move either. 21 sent a shot at Mace too in the same bar. 
Bobby O'Foreign is one of the hottest rappers in the game. Yeah, he is. So he revealed that Mace only gave him a 5K advance when he signed him back in 2019. 5K advance is so bad, it's basically an insult. That's it. That's Mace it? Bobby was capping, Come on, Mace, bro. 750 cap. No, I gave him 750,000. It's not clear what actually went down behind the scenes. I don't know, scene, bro. But 21 is letting everyone know he's not going to let his artist starve like that. Ice Spice started making waves. That's her name, Ice Spice. Couldn't Pop catch her name. Track much. The track went viral and got the attention of Drake, who went to the flying ice out to OVO Fest. Fans thought he was either looking to sign her or just smash. Yeah. And then a few days later, he unfollowed her on social media. Now, he's allegedly taking shots at her on his new song. On the track Back Outside Boys, he said, Love on me. Stay down just like a root. She a ten trying to rap. It's good on mute. Oh Even yeah, saying she can't rap for shit, but well, she look good. Immediately linked the bar to Ice. Even she thought the line was aimed at her. And later she tweeted, "At least I'm a ten with a laugh in the." I mood. remember that too. Even if Drake did send the shot at her, it'll end up getting more eyes on Ice and her music. It will. Like they say, there's no such thing as bad press. Not at all. Back in 2015, when Drake dropped Hotline Bling, fire track of Jack and his song Cha Cha. When Drum tried to press him over it. He says Drake's security team put hands on them, but Drake wouldn't run the one-on-one -on -one fade. It's been a while since it went down, but Drake hasn't forgotten. On the track Back Outside Boys, he said, Back Outside Boys, toting the 70 on the strip, I'm ready to die. Cutting the traction, been in the corner, bet I'll make the shit glide. Try to bring the drama to me, he ain't know how we cha-cha slide. Mm. Drum clapped back and tweeted, woke up to some shit and posted a video responding to the line. He admitted that Drake's bodyguards went to town on the kid, but challenged Drake to pull up for a fair one-on-one. -on -one. Right. His bodyguards Shoot the fade, big dog. I ain't gonna hold you. His bodyguards went to town on the kid. But his bodyguards did not his... Right. He didn't touch me. He no, they, was gonna, they gotta protect this nigga. Okay. He also brought up the time did he allegedly smack Drake up after he stole the track, zero to 100 from him. Oh, yeah. I remember that. that I remember that, too. Diddy or some shit. According to Diddy, he sent Drake the beat for him to ghostwrite his verse. But Drake ended up taking the track for himself. Diddy denied putting hands on him and even called Drake his favorite rapper. But witnesses say he caught Drake outside the club, roughed him up. It seems like Drum ready to let the past be the past. But now the beef is definitely back on. <laughs> One of the most unexpected disses on Drake and 21's new record was when Drake sent shots at Serena Williams' husband, Alexis O'Hanna. I heard about that. Track, he said, sidebar, Serena, your husband a groupie. He claimed we don't got a problem, but no, boo. It is like you coming for sushi. We might pop up on him at will like Suzuki. Drake and Serena dated for a while a long time ago. Yeah. Nobody expected him to go after her husband. O'Haney oh, co-founded Reddit. There's pretty much zero chance he opts in a booth to clap back. Right. Instead, he responded by posting a picture of him and his daughter looking at Serena from the stands with the caption, The reason I stay winning is because I'm relentless about being the absolute best at whatever I do. That's he dope. That's a good comeback. <laughs> I think Drake was on some he other shit. Responded to the line yet, but it looks like she moved on a long time ago anyway. Drake and Nicki Minaj have been tight for years. Yeah. He allegedly sent a shot at her op, Cardi B, on the track on BS. He said, it's been 30 minutes, I don't feel nothing. Oh shit, wait a minute, I think I'm starting to feel something. Where you get this motherfucking pill from? Back in 2019, a video came out where Cardi admitted that she used to drug and rob dudes when she was a stripper. Word? I didn't know that. After the video started going around, she hopped on social media and said she just did what she had to do back then to survive. But a lot of people dragged her online and even compared her to Bill Cosby. Oh, damn. So allegedly bringing it back up to diss her. Cardi hasn't clapped back yet, but hopefully she doesn't start throwing shoes like when her and Nikki got into a fight. That's crazy, TV. dog. Dog, that's crazy, bro. I didn't... Drake, a lot of I, a lot of the bars I missed when I first heard the album. I didn't know he was violating all of them, bro. He was going in, bro. Man, Ice Spice, Megan, Cardi, Serena's husband. I couldn't pronounce his name. I apologize. Like Kanye, he was just going. I didn't know that Drake was in that type of bag, bro. But I know one thing. You you good luck. Good thing you didn't say Pusha T's name, cause you don't. That's one person. I don't think. I don't think Drake want that smoke, bro. Pusha is a whole different, he's a different animal compared to the rest of them, man. He don't care, he don't give two shits about Drake. So Drake, you know, I rock with your music, but you know what I'm saying? Don't bark up that tree, big dog. Don't bark up that tree, my man. You do not want that Pusha T smoke, and that is a fact, my boy. And Drake was going in on everybody, man. That shit is crazy, I did not know that. A lot of the bars I missed, I caught some of the stuff with Megan and, um, and, 
Ice Spice, you know what I'm saying? But it's crazy, bro. But yeah, shout out to them. It was a dope album anyway, but yeah, crazy. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed your reaction to this video. If you enjoyed my reaction, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to the Dope Guy Big Dog. Hit the notification bell whenever I upload. From right here on Snapchat, the Instagram right across the bottom screen. Any other videos you may check out, please comment under this video and my other videos. And also leave likes and comments on all my videos. It's gonna help grow the channel, help with the algorithm. I appreciate y'all on God. But yeah, man, it's the Dope Guy and I am out. Yes, sir, we go.